My name is Frederick Norberg and I am a distant relative in Sweden. I'm making a book about your great-grandfather, Petter Norberg, who left Sweden for Canada in 1898. His brother, Alfred Norberg, is my great-grandfather. It would be a pleasure to connect with you and hopefully find out more about Petter's life in Canada. Holy smokes! My great-grandfather was Alfred. Peter's brother, and she's the great granddaughter of Peter. Kajupat, Kajetain, Unatakugiago Kajetaoya Kutitara Viuunga Peter Norberg, or Iluliago here, Frederick Norberg. Han är så pass, ändå så pass okänd på något sätt för de flesta här i Sverige i alla fall. Uh, och då kände jag att men det här är ju roligt liksom, för det här är. Det, är liksom, det här vet inte folk riktigt om och nu finns det liksom en chans att föra fram det på något sätt. Hello. Hello. How nice to see you in person. Yeah. Love for you to come and see Kogloto, our community, meet all your many relatives. We had a super day yesterday. We had 40 direct descendants of Peter Norberg graduating at the Kogloto High School. So you have lots of relations over here. It seems a little strange that we have slekting that are long away from the world, almost far away from the unknown places that are almost not mentioned at all. There is almost no information here in Sweden about this area at all. It is completely unknown. We don't know anything about them. It popped up right to their right. Right here, friend. Yeah, just went down. Right in front of me. I know I hope. Ah, just when he went down. Gimmick. We haven't eaten seal meat pretty much all summer. And we're really craving the meat. Tundra received this 223 rifle because she's now becoming a hunter. So that was her grad gift from her parents. And being grandfather Johnny Norberg's first grandchild, I learned a lot of the skills, and I still use them today if we have the animals. No one that I know does anything like that because I just go to the store and buy it. <laughs> <laughs> Exciting to see me, uh, someone I can communicate with in English. And I was thinking as I looked at him, I said, oh, he must be a Norberg. He's getting as bald as my uncle's. <laughs> I didn't want to tell him that. <laughs> Det är väl lite att man kan bara skriva sig så mycket eh, och använda sin fantasi på och tänka sig hur det kanske kunde varit. Men till slut så måste man ju åka till platsen och ja, se hur det är på riktigt. The Mother Hubbard makes pullover. We still wear them, we all look beautiful. Has Wolverine on the bottom. 
wolverine here and this is the wolf and it's called a sunburst. That's my mother Hubbard. 